In this video, I want to talk about my experience on Duolingo or someone called Duolingo English test. And I took this test around last, last week and I just took it once time and I already got the results. And here it is, let me show it to you. Yeah, this is my results. So I got 125, okay, uh, in the test. And then my literacy, 130, pretty nice. Comprehension, 113. Conversation, 115. Production, 115. And the comment can understand a variety of demanding written and spoken language, including some special language use situation can grasp implicit uh, figurative, figurative. Uh, problematic and uh, idiomatic language can use language flexibly and effectively for most social, academic, and professional purposes. Well, first, uh, uh, when, uh, first, uh, how come I know this test is because uh, uh, some friends mention it, I mentioned it, and then uh, they just recommend me to take it, so I just took it for fun, okay, just for fun, and I did not study at all, okay, I did not study at all before the test, so, when I know this test, and then I pay by credit card, and then I took it. So the whole process, I spent around 1.5 hours, okay. Yeah, I, I spent around uh, 30 minutes to know more about what, what the tests are. And actually, uh, I took one pretty test, okay. I took one pretty test, and then and then that's it, okay, and then I'll just uh, simply pay for it and then I got the results and then, yeah and the uh, uh, Duolingo uh, is so efficient because within around 8 hours I already, oh, I already got the test 8 hours, so uh, they were so professional, so fast, so quick and I appreciate their efficiency, it's amazing and then this result is pretty good because, as I mentioned, I did not study at all, okay? And it's quite fun, actually. It's quite fun, actually. And for the test, it, it costs you around 60 minutes. But honestly, I just spent around 40 minutes because for each task, there are some uh, time limit, okay? And I, I, I never use a span of the time. Maybe it gives you around 50 seconds. And generally, uh, I'll just spend around 15 seconds finishes, and then I'll just simply leave for the next one. So in this video, I want to share uh, some of the tips, okay, and some some useful advice to you. And if you find it useful, please subscribe and like this video. So maybe I will use the practice test, okay, use the practice test to talk about how to prepare for the doing good. Waiting? Yes, she is at home. Oh, so for for this, okay, um, you need to click yes, it. Yes, she is at home. And then tap it. And then generally, the first time you hear it, just try your best to take something. So for example, we heard that she is at home. And then you click again, and then yes, she is at home. We wait. Yes, she is at home. Uh, I generally will prefer to add those comma, okay, and full stop. It's my practice because I will find it more professional. And then for this one, okay, you need to. There are so many different words, okay. And then I just click. A dividend, wardis, stother. So maybe you wonder, oh, I don't know if there are such real English words. I don't know if such words are really real English or just some uh, make-up word, okay? I know such word actually. And the easier things to do is uh, your first instinct, instinct, okay? When you hear a word, okay, actually, you will never find it 50-50. In your mind, maybe you will have a little bit think it look like a word or you have a little bit feeling that oh I don't think it's a word now use this little bit feeling okay and then try to answer the question for example 
Past. Past. Of course, English, right? Office. Office. Of course, the office. Interested. Interested. Of course. Stake. Stake. Of course. Tourist. Tourist. Average. Eh. Average. Average. Oh. Stother. Eh. Ah. For example. Uh. For this word. For this word. Uh. When I heard about it, the first thing is I find it a bit strange. Strange. So I will find. Oh, it's so strange. Okay. I don't think it's the correct word. So I will simply don't choose it. Okay. Oh, because the time limit. And that's my 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 style. And then for this, how how I do it? For example, okay. Uh, so I will first when I see the word, I will look at it very very quick. Okay, I won't. You can see that I look it very quick, right? You can see it. And the way why I look very quick is, uh. Our mindset, our subconscious mind, is so powerful. But the first impression, we already have the most accurate feeling. So when I when I look at it very fast, then I can get the most raw feeling. And those raw feeling without any artificial impact, and it will help me to identify if it's the real English words or not. Uh, physical exercise is recommended for management of raw、uh, depression and has a moderate effect on sim 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 symptom. Ah,、uh, this one I'm not so sure. Symptoms. Okay, it is equivalent to the use of medicine. M E D R C R E med med. Medical? Oh, only this one. I'm not sure. Or visual, visual, psychological. Therapy for most people. In older people, it does appear to decrease. Let me check again. This exercise is recommended for management of male depression and has a moderate impact of on symptoms. Yeah, yeah, I think symptom. It is equivalent to the use of med, medical, medical or M E D R C R, med, medicine, medical. Oh, this one is quite different. Med, med, medological. No, 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 no such thing. With this, um, of medical medicine. Oh yeah. Uh, also, uh, if you guys like and comment on this video, I will tell you、uh, how. Okay.、Uh, how what you should do. Okay, to make sure the Dalingo know that you pay one hundred percent concentration on the test. Okay, because some、uh, so many people said that even they pay absolute attention on the test, they did not cheat. But somehow,、uh, the system just、uh, misunderstand and think, oh, that you are cheating or something. Okay, so so many people have such complaint. I、uh, I receive uh uh I heard that in social uh, social uh, forum, and so many people said that. So I think、uh, there are so many techniques I can teach you. Okay, and I think the set the setest thing is when you really be an absolute honest, and when you. Really, one hundred percent focus on the test, and when you did not do anything wrong, but when the system thought you did something wrong, then it is so frustrating and so upsetting. I understand it. So, uh, if you guys like this video, and if the feel of this video is quite good, I will teach you because I just take the test for one times, and then the Duolingo or already believe I am honest and. I、uh, did not cheat and just、uh, mark my paper and give me the score within eight hours. And and there are some techniques I use, okay, to make sure that they did not mi misunderstand. Okay, now remember, you must be absolutely honest in the Duolingo English test. Never cheat, okay. Ah,、uh, and because you, if you cheat, you 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 don't deserve this test, okay. 
This test helps a lot of people because in some territories, uh, there are no other professional English tests, and then they use Duolingo uh, English tests for their career or their education. Okay, the Duolingo test help them a lot. So, uh, people, please don't treat or uh, do something that will damage the reputation of the test. Okay, if you do it, okay, then simply close this video. Don't watch my video because you do not deserve my video. Okay, just close this browser. Okay, and so yeah, um, but uh, I will not teach you the technique in this video. Maybe maybe next time, next later. Yeah. Record yourself saying the statement below. Let's see. It is possible that he will pass the exam. Look, very easy. Preventure. Acquaintance. Devastating. Integrate. Pit. Pit. Pony. Contrapolic. Domacy. Sensibility. Preventure. Acquaintance. Pit. 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 I don't know. Domacy. Contrapolic. We had to put off the meeting because of the storm. Of the storm. We had to put off the meeting because of the storm. Yeah. We had to put off the meeting because of the storm. Yeah. So now you can also uh, have, uh, maybe I'll finish this one as well. Oh, so that's the end of this video. I hope you guys find it useful. And uh, honestly, there are so many different skills I can teach you, but I think uh, I don't have uh, this feed. I don't want to make this video too long. So, as uh, uh, maybe if you uh, if there are good response, okay, from you guys in uh, on this video, I will make one more or one or two more. And I hope that it can help you, okay. And you can see that by by listening my English, you know that I'm not very good at English, I guess, right? But somehow the point is, uh, you need to know how to. Uh, play the game. Okay, you need to know the rule of the game. If you don't, okay, then it's just a waste of your time or a, a waste of your money. So, um, I hope. Yeah, I'm honestly I'm quite proud of myself. Okay, not very good, but remember I did not study at all, and then I simply talk. 1.5 hours to finish it, so I'm pretty, I feel pretty great on myself, yeah, that's pretty nice. Oh, for interview and certificate, okay, uh, um, if if you guys really want to know it, I will show it more to you, but it's quite, privacy, uh, quite perfect, okay, so I will not disclose it now, okay. So I hope you guys like my video and I really enjoyed the test in Duolingo English test and I find it's a revolutionary uh, method, okay? I think it's a revolutionary method and it will be the biggest competitor to ours and TOEFL, yeah. And I believe that one day Duolingo will dominate in the international English test. I have such feeling, yeah. So if you guys want to take it, uh, please take it. And if you guys want to know more about Duolingo English test, please leave your question in the comment. I will read and reply all your comments. Thank you very much.